Hello guys, welcome back. I'm Julian. I'm here to do my reaction video for season 3 episode 8 of Drake and Josh. This time the title of the episode is I think it's pronounced paging Dr. Drake. Because if not, I don't know how to pronounce that. Uh anyway, so here we are. We're in episode 8. Um last episode was really funny. It was really funny, really, really good episode <laughs> for Drake and Josh. This season so far has been doing great. Like, I don't think I have laughed as much as I have during this season. It has been really good, you know? Um, and having Helen and having everyone, you know, it's just... And Megan is a lot more incorporated into the show, you know, with... Uh, her one-liners or her evil stares. Like, I love that, honestly. Megan is such an amazing character. And I can't believe that uh, uh, Mir 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 uh, Miranda, Mir Miranda, Miranda, I don't know how do you say it in English. Uh, she went from psychopathic <laughs> uh, Megan to the sweetest girl. I, I, on iCarly, you know, uh, to play Carly. Um, so that that was that was amazing. That that's amazing. I love her. I, I she's so talented. Um, and yeah, so we're here now for episode eight. Uh, I hope you guys enjoy. Hope you guys like it. Hope you guys continue supporting for more because I will be doing more reaction videos for Drake and Josh. Uh, today I'm gonna do one more episode, so stay tuned for that because it will be posted as soon as I I finish this one. So. Thank you for watching. Thank you for all your support. You guys are amazing. Thumbs up, subscribe, comment, hit notification bell. Uncar reactions always posted first on Patreon. Thank you for watching. Thank you for all your support. You guys are incredible. And for now, I think that's about it. I hope you guys enjoy. And without further ado, let's just begin with season three, episode eight of Drake and Josh. Here we go. Yeah. <laughs> I hate it when Drake gets me into situations. I love getting Josh into situations. <laughs> Once, I entered Josh into a chicken wing eating contest. They were very upset. Oh, come on. They were so mad, they threw Josh in a lake. <laughs> oh my god. I was a few things that day. Number one, the people for chicken's rights. <laughs> Crazy. <laughs> Josh, not the best swimmer. <laughs> last, chicken wings. Pretty, Pretty good. good. <laughs> I love chicken wings too. Hey, check out my bicep. How does it feel? Kind of like a plastic bag filled with pudding. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. What do you think you're doing? Turning down the air conditioning so I don't freeze to death. Have the thermostats in our room. So knit yourself a sweater, little girl. <laughs> don't be don't mean. Go yeah, for it. Hold it. Hold it. Stop. Hold it. Oh my god. I trade. Mom, there's a bug on the wall. Josh, go kill the bug. <laughs> oh. Go kill the bug. <laughs> right now. Okay. Oh. What up with the cane? Oh. <laughs> Josh. Oh. Pieces to go to a hospital. You Why? Really oh my god! They're gonna have to amputate the, that foot. What the fuck? It's like mom's meatloaf. Oh my god! <laughs> Stop it. Which tastes so good. <laughs> you could lose that foot. Yeah. I love this foot. Come on, we have to get him to the hospital yeah. right now. It's not that serious. But his foot will require a bit of surgery. See you! <gasps> oh, <laughs> you're not going anywhere. <laughs> say something to your brother before you go. I hope you don't die. <laughs> Scrape the metatarsal bones? Ah! Uh, uh, Woozy! <laughs> yeah, don't search it on the internet. It's never a good Good idea. Yes. <laughs> what are you doing? If they catch you, they will put you in jail. I would not do well in jail. No, you will not. Your doctor Nussbaum. <laughs> he is not. Yes. Elliot Nussbaum, the youngest surgeon to ever graduate from Harvard Medical School. Oh shit. I mean, yes. And 
doctors in training here would benefit so much more by watching you do it than myself. <gasps> I don't know how. <laughs> oh, score another one for Nussbaum. <laughs> sure. Hello. Who are all these people? I hope it's okay, Dr. Nussbaum, but when the hospital staff found out that you were performing the surgery, well, everyone wanted to observe. Oh, I just wanted to clean up a little. Make sure everything's nice for Josh when he gets home from the hospital. Any idea how lucky he is to have a little sister like you? It's okay. He His knows. happiness is my reward. <laughs> Spoke like a true psychopath. <laughs> Why don't you start the operation already? Shut up! Uh, making a small incision by big toe bone. Hello, everyone! Sorry, I am late. Oh, I am Dr. Oh, Josh. Uh, Vichy Swaz. Uh, before we start the surgery, I, I must speak to Dr. Nussbaum privately. Completely lost your mind? What? You're seriously gonna operate on a person? <laughs> what am I supposed to do? You're the one that told me I could get arrested for pretending to be a doctor. Just follow my lead. He asked me out. He asked oh. me out. He made out with me. Oh, shit. Yes, Bob, you dog. Well, of course he says that. Yes, doctor, we really need to get... You kissed my wife? <laughs> I can't believe you after all we've been through together at Harvard. I gotta punch you, So man. if you punch me, I will punch you back. No, hey, you can't punch you see my wife. <laughs> Is my foot fixed? Um, how do we tell you this? This is Dr. Nussbaum. <laughs> you mean he's an imposter? Oh my god. Are you aware that you could go to prison? I don't know. I would have done that. <laughs> 31 degrees and dropping. Oh, wonderful. Right, what'd you do? I just modified the air conditioning in your room. You guys did say you like it cold, right? <laughs> Shove the potato in here, but it wasn't supposed to go off until I pressed the... Good. <laughs> oh! oh! <laughs> mm. Okay, guys, so that was the end of Season 3, Episode 8 of Drake and Josh. And I have to tell you something, guys. I know this is old jokes, right? But what is not a joke is that one time, actually it has been more than one time, I think, but the one that I remember is that a man, uh, old guy, uh, that had, I think had diabetes. So sadly, his, let's say, right leg had to be amputated. Right? So they take him to the hospital, everything. He goes into the operating room, comes out, and they realize, it is no joke, that the doctors cut off the other leg, the healthy one. And they have left the one that was you know, ready to be amputated, there. No joke. The poor man suffer like he like he can't like imagine you have to go in and lose a leg, right? Because circulation, diabetes got complicated. He was about to lose his leg. And he comes out and the one leg that was right, the doctors didn't think too much of it. And cut it off. And then he had to go back into this surgery room. Because that other leg had to be amputated. So now. He doesn't have any of his two legs. Doesn't have legs. The poor dude. The poor old man. No. Well, he was older. You know. I don't know how old he was. But. Um, he actually died from depression. From seeing himself. Um, you know, uh, not having both legs. I mean, like I said, hard enough, traumatizing enough to lose one. And but imagine losing two because of a, a, a doctor's mal malpractice. You know, awful, isn't it? And it happens in this wonderful country of mine. Anyways, um, so. <laughs> 
Uh, this episode was really fun. I was like, when I read the title, and it was like, Dr. Drake, and I was like, yeah, Drake is not a doctor. <laughs> he's not smart enough to pull that off. Like, nah, because he's like, he is, he's not doing great at school. We always told that. He doesn't do homework. He just spends his time chasing after girls and like, you know, kissing here, kissing there. That's his game, you know? So for him to apply himself to become a doctor, that wasn't going to happen. But turns out that uh, he uh, actually made, um, well, caused an injury to Josh with his potato luncher or something like that. And it broke Josh's foot. And Josh was so scared of going to a hospital you know, uh, that he, you know, for a couple of days, he was not, you know, telling mom and dad until it was just impossible not to tell him, to tell them. And, you know, his foot was just about like, it was this close, I think, for him to lose his, his foot, honestly. Uh, so he had to, had surgery to fix what it was broken. Um, but Drake <laughs> gets himself in trouble. Again, because it's Drake, you know, he always thinks that he can outsmart people and he's not smart enough to outsmart people, you know what I mean? Uh, but bless his soul, he always tries. Uh, so he sees that the nurses are really cute and of course the nurses are like 20 something and he's 16, I think, 15, 16. And so he's like, oh, but you know, uh, I'm gonna make myself look older Honestly, he looked like a kid that was dressed as a doctor about to go, uh, you know, ask for candy on Halloween, trick-and-treating on Halloween. He didn't look like a f freaking doctor. I don't understand why anyone believed that he was one. Uh, but for the sake of comedy, he did, you know. And so um, it's illegal to impression impress impersonate yeah, uh, a doctor. He was about to operate, dude. So, thing is that uh, he was flirting with some of the nurses, kisses some of them, got phone numbers and all of that. And honestly, I'm like, I am perplexed that none of them thought that he was way too young. But hey, it's his charm, I guess. I don't know. But the thing is that he uh, gets himself wrapped in this thing and he, he could have said, no, I'm not actually Dr... No, no, no spawn or whatever. I'm actually some other doctor, and I have to, I have to go. I have some things to attend. Goodbye. No, but he gets wrapped into this. This is the youngest man, the youngest, uh, uh, the doctor surgeon that has come out of Harvard, and he's excellent, and blah blah blah. And we're gonna guess it's not the time for the internet or for you resume to be on LinkedIn with your photos. Or you know, people know what you look like before you go into uh, a procedure or something like that, or you walk into a hospital. Um, and he was about to <laughs> do the surgery uh, until Josh very bravely got out of his bed, even though he must have been in extreme pain, uh, to help his brother, you know? And so he did. He did help his brother. And... Uh, at the end, what I thought should have been option A was him throwing himself out of the window, which is not a great idea, but, you know, it was either that or getting arrested. But at the same time, I'm like, okay, but he got out the window, right? But then he had to be admitted again because he had a fracture, right? So wouldn't they put him in jail after that as well? But no, that, that fixed the problem. But it's okay because... Come on, like I said, this is not CSI, okay? So they don't have to be precise with everything that they do and say this is a comedy show made for children that I'm watching and having a lot of fun watching it, honestly. Um, so yeah, that happened. It's insane. <laughs> it's insane everything that Drake gets himself into just for the sake of hitting with a girl, you know? So it's just... Man, he's crazy. He is crazy. If he put half the effort he does to actually study and, and you know, 
like half of what he the energy he he puts on hitting on a girl on a girl he put it in his uh uh you know in his uh high school in his studies and all of that he will be doing a lot better i think <laughs> but this episode was hilarious you know it anyway so that's it I hope you guys enjoy. I hope you guys liked it. I hope you guys continue to support for more. Thumbs up if you love Drake and Josh. Hearts if you're want watching on Patreon. Continue to support for more. Because I will be doing more reaction videos for Drake and Josh. I'm actually going to do one more episode tonight. If you are on Patreon. You get to watch episode 9 with me today. And the remaining episodes. We'll do a binge next week. With all the episodes. So stay tuned. <gasps> for that uh but yeah for now that's about it i hope you guys enjoy hope you guys liked it hope you guys continue supporting for more like i said thumbs up all those good things thank you for watching and i'll see you guys next time for more reaction videos for drake and josh that's it see you guys next time Mwah. bye